My name is Chinma Uche. I'm a math and computer science teacher at the Greater Hartford Academy of Math and Science and also at Craig's Academy of Aerospace and Engineering. I started teaching computer science here in 2002, having been a math teacher for a long, long time. Coming here and being introduced to computer science, I discovered computer science was so much fun for students. Often I find it difficult to get students out of the classroom in a computer science class. Computer science was fun, educational, challenging, and completely engaging for students. So it was important, so that made me ask a, few, a number of questions. If my students are having so much fun, why is computer science an elective? Why aren't more students taking computer science? Why isn't there access being given to a, a, a more students to computer science? So I feel it's really important that computer science be taught to all students. And that has actually been what's central to how my life has been organized since that time. I am a member of the Computer Science Teachers Association and a founding member of the Connecticut Computer Science Teachers Association. We as a group understand the need for access for all students to computer science. And we try as much as we can to get people to see what computer science is, know how much fun it is for students, see the opportunities it creates for students who take it. You know, with the, where we are in the digital world now, most jobs of the future require to people who have certain skills. Computer science teaches problem solving, collaboration, persistence, better than any other subject area. So these are skills we need in the future. So one wonders, is there a way we can get all our students to experience computer science? My experience of teaching computer science is that when students have get this chance, they really enjoy it. Schools are being encouraged in so many different ways to bring computer science to their schools. It will prepare your students for the future. It will give them access to skills they never knew they had. Because some of my students come into class thinking, they, they, it's, I can't do computer science. And then they end up really loving it. When I talk to adults about computer science, I just want to make them understand that the tools for teaching computer science now have changed a lot. We now have block-based pro programming, which allows students to transition smoothly to text-based programming. So computer science is not as scary as people thought. Some people think it is. And our students are proving every day that this is real. So what bothers me more than anything else is the possibility of an achievement gap developing. When school districts delay the introduction of computer science, they delay access to this important skill that's going to determine what options a student has for the future. And I actually believe, honestly, that if you bring computer science into your school, it will help you deal with some of the issues that people worry about in school, absenteeism, because students have fun in class every day. Even though it's challenging, students like playing games that they develop themselves, realize that it can be challenging, but it is still fun. It's worth doing and worth doing well. So I encourage every student school and school district to try computer science. One, because we're in the best time to do this. There are so many opportunities to help you develop your computer science program. There are is training available for your teachers. There is um, support. Networks, the Computer Science Teachers Association is there to support your members, your teachers to really do this job well. We want computer science taught and we want it taught very well so that the kids get the best benefits their race to get. And one of the things I've discovered works so well is really a diverse environment. When students work together, 
and they bring in different points of view, they produce a product that's better than they would individually produce. So having a team that involves girls being equipped, boys, especially minority boys, who at times don't seem to know that these things are accessible to them, but they are actually some of the very creative people you have in your classroom. I've had to work with girls by, through what we call the Women in STEM C project that we have hold every December. And girls from across our state come in eager to learn. And when they're introduced to computer science, they really eat it up. So we need to give access to these girls. The technology companies are so male dominated now that if we don't encourage our girls to engage with computer science by providing them opportunity, we're not going to have the diverse environment we need to produce the best tools of the future. There is something women bring to the table. There is something minority boys bring to the table. It's unfortunate that some states don't even have students of color taking computer science. I think this needs to change. I think we need to make sure that all our students are equipped for the future to keep us competitive as a nation, to keep us producing cool things for our world.